Welcome, everyone. In today's video, we'll be diving into an essential topic for Windows users, how to check user login history in both Windows 10 and Windows 11. This can be extremely useful for tracking activities on your system or troubleshooting login issues. So, let's get started. If you want to just find out the last login time for a user you can use the net user command. Open a command line by searching for it in the search box. If you want to just find out the last login time for a user you can use the net user command. Replace SAC with the actual username of the user whose login history you want to check. Look for the line that says last login. This line will display the date and time of the last login for the specified user. Keep in mind that if the user has never logged in, or if the user account is disabled, this information will not be available. To retrieve the last login date and time for all users in Windows 10 or 11, Open PowerShell and execute the following command. Running this command will display the most recent login timestamp for all accounts on your Windows 10 or 11 system. If a user's last logon time is empty, it indicates that the user has never accessed the computer. I only have one account on this computer. You can also use the Event Viewer to check who has logged into your computer and when. Search for Event Viewer in the search box and hit Enter. Once you're in the Event Viewer, we'll be looking for a specific event log related to logins. Go to Windows Logs then Security. To make your life easier, create a custom view. Click on Create Custom View on the right-hand side. In Event ID, type 4624 which is the event ID for successful login. 4647 is for log off. You can also select a time range instead of checking everything which can be time consuming. Click OK to save the changes. Give the custom view a name for easy identification and then click on OK. Great job! Now you can see a list of login events on your system. In Security Logs, open one by one all the events with event ID 4624 and find which one has as logon type 2 and an account name shows the username of a user and not the system name. If you see type 5 then the logon is for the system and not a user. This is a type 2 which means the log is for a user account and the process is the same even on Windows 10. I have switched to a Windows 10 machine. The account name is user. You can also use a third-party tool to view logon and logoff times. In my view this is the most straightforward method to view the login and logout history of all users. Download the tool from this site. The tool was developed for Windows 10 and it might not work on Windows 11. After download just extract the tool and run it. Displayed on your screen will be the login and logout times for each computer user, along with the total duration of their session and the corresponding IP address they used to connect. And there you have it, folks. You now know how to check user login history in both Windows 10 and Windows 11 using the Event Viewer. This can be invaluable for monitoring system access and troubleshooting login issues. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more tech tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.